Hello everybody, I'm Raphael Perry and I'm playing some more War Tales. Now at this point I am probably once again in trouble. Our company doesn't have the money to pay the wages of our rum. Surly bunch of reprobates. I should have taken the harder job. Okay, I see wolves, that's a problem. So some hunters have gone off missing in the forest. It's very dangerous and nobody warned them. So we're going to go and do that. And when we come back, we'll get paid. We'll pay off people's... It would be nice to partially pay wages if we have built up a, a you know, a solid amount that needs paying. Like, so if we're going to take like two, three hundred worth of wages, if we get like a hundred paid back, can we pay some of our wages or do we have to pay it all in one go? Right. We get to camp. That's great. We get to eat. Uh, that's also great because these are heavy. One, two, three, four, five. And we'll have some apples. There we go. No, I don't want to pay people. Oh, right. Okay. And some grapes. There we go. Well, I want to pay people. I just can't. Right. And you... Uh, let's have Boric check. We can make that, make that, no. The good things that we need stuff for, we can't make yet. Okay, good to know. Right. Let's finish camping and head back out looking for these hunters. You know what? Maybe they'll even be in trouble. Perhaps they'll need to be rescued. And then we can, like, pick up some stuff like that on the way back make a bit of money I think they might be up here and I think I'm picking that up whatever it is anyway and then I find out oh yeah yeah they've gone up into the mountains after those more elusive prey you know the deadly ones that will rip their face off hey are you the people we're looking for Oh mate, is it always an attack for a for a quest objective? Is is it just for sword? We came to hunt for food, but our families for our families but the animals here their calls are enough to make your hair stand on end. I'm beginning to wonder if we did the right thing coming here, but now that we're here we can't go back empty handed. Um I apparently have the pork. Explain that this mountain is extremely dangerous for experienced hunters. Requires 20... Sh oh, rope! Yes, please. I see. Thank you for warning us. We were venturing into unknown territory. Thanks to you, we will go back to our families safe and sound. Mate, if you were going hunting with just two pitchforks between the three of you... Look, we got some rope. So we can, um, you know, things and stuff. We can make stuff with the rope, right? And we know this is extremely dangerous as well. So let's not go over there. Woo, yeah. I'll see it, don't worry. Now, what were we making with the rope? It was... Was it the black, something at the blacksmiths or something at the other place? I can't remember. That weight is going to be a problem on the journey back. Oh, whatever it is. Was that thunder? Was that the rumble of thunder? Or is it just like really loud hooves? Well... Whatever it is, we'd better get moving. Hmm. So, this is a somewhat nice, relaxing stroll. It would be nice if there was a way to open menus without everything pausing automatically, but I can live with that. So, pittons, torches, what do we make with rope? Um, we need the cloth. We don't have the cloth. Uh, 
Oh, we can make the pistons with rope, right? We've got the iron ore and the rope, so we make that. Get some uh, more knowledge. In fact, we can do that now, right? Let's say Fernal. Make that. Bonus failed. Normal quality item. But that's fine. We still got the knowledge, right? We don't need them. We don't need that. Um, more wood and metal. Cloth. We, we need the cloth. Right. We're just not getting the cloth. A bit more wood for another shield. We don't need that. Throwing knife. Ah! Get some more wood. Make a throwing knife or a throwing axe. That would be goodish. Let's leave camp. Move on. Uh, 62. Oh, we are really close. Okay. Miscellaneous. Can be used to hang a rope and descend from steep heights. Um, do we have a use for that? Or is it just something we can sell? I'm not entirely sure. But yes, at this early stage, we're getting lots of nice roaming around, you know, meander through relatively safe territory. Not too many enemies. And we are very close to getting another knowledge point. So we should absolutely endeavor to do that. Oh, I see a gibbet over there. Wonder if we can rescue someone from that to work in our company. Some vagabond, no doubt. Probably not. We we probably get to go. Ah, you're an evil villain. Look at you, rot. So yeah, the gibbet is a big metal cage hangs on a frame by the side of a road in a very visible place, in which prisoners, criminals, in fact, would be hung on display to wither and die. Maybe they'd live on a bit if the people were merciful and gave them some some food and drink. But generally they'd starve and suffer and people would mock them, throw stones at them, call them bad names. You know, all the lovely things that people have done to each other in the past. And I don't just mean in school playgrounds. Right, so we need... Ah, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, of course, needing to find out. Oh, would you say? Why, that's perfect, I say. Look, um... So we got a couple of issues, right? First off, we get to say... Hello. You know. We can't pay people. We can rest. Uh, let's drag uh, Fernal over here. I don't know if him being next to it will help at all. Right. We can make this. This. Can't make these things. Okay, no. It's a blacksmith jobby. Right. Off we go. And now, significantly less encumbered. So we should go quite a bit quicker. Oh, hello, he says. But, but, but it'll be heavy. But we get things and stuff. Help us be a better mercenary company of useless criminal thugs. Oh, yes, the mood is going down because we ain't paying people. Let's get back to town and get our wages in order. Yes, yes, I know. We uh, will barely be able to do that. Right. Into the inn. Please, sir, can we have our pay? We are not Oliver Twist. Will that automatically go straight? I don't know. Right, look, we need work. Um, desperate refugees. Yeah, look, we don't have the money. Um, wait, that's east. This is east. I'm liking this idea, right? Right. 
Yes, they're right next to each other. Perfect. Oh, we can take a third one. Yeah, that might be asking a bit much. Um, let's live really dangerously. Okay, so in the interest of not being dead, um, can I make something? Yes, I can make something. What can I make? Not you, not you. Ah, yes, right. Throwing axe or throwing knife? I'll go with the throwing knife. Where are you? You are there. I will hit you with a hammer. Progress made in your discoveries has earned you a knowledge point. That's great. Um, and we made a discovery. That's also great. Uh, we still don't have the cloth. What did we learn today? Uh, so we should have unlocked something after making that throwing knife, right? Uh, iron plated roundel. Should I make a rondel? No, a rondel would be a, a dagger. A roundel, sure. Um, okay, so these are just flat out knowledge. All right. A tent and cooking pot would be lovely if we could get the things from. Uh, so, knowledge then. Um, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What do we want? What do we want? So we could go for a weapon, right? Absolutely. Or for something here. Yeah, weight training sounds really good. There we go. We can carry more stuff now. Excellent. Let's leave town immediately camp pay our wages be really broke and leave all right so yeah over here basically north or south of the lake uh both veer towards the south i think but let's see well, we're going north now, so we might as well stick with it and pick those up. Hmm. So yeah, uh, things are generally replenishing for us to pick up all over the place. Now, what we need to do is not run into the refugees before we've dealt with the uh, ruffians. So we should absolutely be going this way, but that wood looks very tasty and needs to be picked up. Oh, okay, we've gone from 62 to 67, so it's been a five weight increase. And we will no doubt be heavily encumbered soon. Now, I don't... Oh, up the mountains... Please, no, it's up the bloody mountains again. Right, there's got to be a way. Got to be a way up there. And that's not it. Lovely. Just lovely. Um, okay, well, look, if that is the case, we can go looking for the other people we need to help, right? Um, lovely. Okay, troops... Are Really? They're unhappy with the size of the company? They think there's too many? They're like, oh, too many people, too many wages, too many mouths to feed. How dare you? How dare you take this on? It's very irresponsible of you. I'm not getting paid. They're all greedy buggers. They're mercenaries, after all. Oh, hey, is this where we go looking for enemies? Or there? Um... Oh, but this is the easy one. We don't want the easy one. We want the hard one. Which will be up this way. Okay, okay. Up this mountainside. Up the grassy part. And you are a location I would love to visit later on when we feel much more competent. Oh, hello. Are you nasty bastards? 
I think you are nasty bastards. I think you are nasty bastards we should kill. The abandoned tower doesn't have a skull. Interesting. Oh, another bunch there. Okay, so that's the Magar gang. Let's do it. Oh, there's quite a few of them. Are we supposed to have a high death rate? Like a very high turnover rate? And then those of us who are more... Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six... Oh! Okay. Let's pop you here. And then you... There. Now, what else? You can go there. You can go there. You... Da Got it. Love it. You are... Poacher. Where are you? One, two, three, four. Where is their... Final person? Ah, it's you. Okay. Alright, I think we're good to go. Right. Uh, Gertrude, I would like you to leg it up to this spear. Pick it up. Lob it. Right like that, yeah. And you can go there, go there, go there, go there. Whack. Good start. Really good start. Love it. Uh, yeah, just run up there. Wallop. Oh, yeah. There's a prison. Oh, that's not worth it because it doesn't get us anything, um, any money. Oh, where did you come from? Well, you may be in for a surprise. Look, we came down to the woods today and they were full of snow. I'll piss off with your poison. Right. It's not going to get us to any of them. Okay. But this is. Oh, hell. Oh. Oh, bugger. Yeah, we're screwed. I think he's dead. There's nothing we can do about it. Where the hell did they come from? Hello, you. You're going to get stabbed. We might even live. I mean, poor Boric won't. I think he's going to be no longer a member of the company. And Vidard might also suffer. How the hell? I mean, where did they even come from? That didn't... Huh. No, it does tally. I think there was about six of them. Right. So, are we on a new round? We're on a new round. Okay, lovely. Well, look, you're going to die of poison any moment, so you might as well punch the person first. Ugh. Oh, mate, now she's dying as well. Right. You can do medicine. You can't. You can't. You can't. You can't. You've gone already. Right. Well, look. Poison, poison, poison. Nasty. Attack before you die. Right. Oh, hello. Well, okay then. Oh, that's a trap. Right, well, look, it's a trap, but bash. You know what I mean? What's this? Yes, uh, that's that's not going to do much against poison now, is it? Okay, great. And he's going to die from the poison next turn. They don't even need to stand there.
Oh, piss off. This whole poison thing, it's... It feels very bad, right? It feels like everyone has way too much poison access. And it's also really messing with our company's ability to survive. In fact, our enemies may have won this one. Alright, I need you to kill this bugger. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? Okay. Then I need you to run on over there with some medicine and save his life. Oh, and you got poisoned by some poison cloud as well. Brilliant. Well, that's quite annoying. Right. Go to the... No, there's no point. You, um... You, you swing wide would kill him and... Oh, for goodness sake! Oh, right, yeah, just stab him with a pitchfork. So, my gut feeling here is that we're supposed to take a lot of heavy losses in the early game, and those lucky enough to survive... Okay... You've asked for this, pal. Will be the ones who... So it's not like you can mark someone out right from the beginning and go, okay, I'm going to look after this person, because they got very little chance of surviving until rank two or three. Right. And this woman's dead as well. Whatever I do. I can't get to her with medicine at all anyway. And you are a big problem. Right, okay. We can't get you into the fight. You are still heavily put. Are you the only one who can cure poison? I think you're the only one who can cure poison. Right, okay. Let's hammer. Oh, it's not enough. Okay. It's enough. And we should try and get him something more than a club. Mate, get on up there with your health. You're one of the few things keeping other party members alive. Right. Oh, I should have... Never mind. Right. Oh, this is bad. Oh, well. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, just hit him. That's great. Ah, it's going to be her turn, isn't it? Yeah, can we just, like, walk towards the healer and then die from poison? Because... I really hope the frequency of poison in the early game gets reduced near a release. Because otherwise, that's just really horrible. Okay. So, either I'm doing something incredible incredibly bad or okay okay how about you so yeah either that or I'm missing something really serious because everyone just gets poisoned and died or dies all the time And then we don't have a company to continue playing with. Right, so, a prayer book dedicated to the eye and to Jeru. And some cloth, finally. Look, we can make and start. We can mend everything because everyone else is dead, right? 
and we don't have the strength to carry all their stuff. Great. Reach level 2 in the power and might path. Um, which gives us an extra point of, of yellow valor or vigor. Right, well, we def desperately, definitely want to camp. You. Um, yes, we would like to a sprain. Don't have any medicine. Okay, lovely. Right, fine. You get to level. Uh, willpower is good for you, this level. Bit of strength, bit of critical. Go for willpower. Yeah, sure. All right. Defensive stance. We've got deflection. So we got encouragement, and you can use a shield, but we don't know what one handed weapons you can use. You can't use two handed axes for starters. Um. Who's going to deflection if they engage in combat? You gain one. To, okay. Uh, Valorous chain. Good for AoEs. Um, Valorous jewel engages in combat. Sure. Um, I found theirs. That's kind of a belt box of stuff. Looks like a crossbow bolts or something, or, or cloth. Hmm. And we got a prisoner that we don't need. Uh, can we have Fernal make something? Yes. Nothing that will get us knowledge, though. Okay. We'll eat that. 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 And then we need to get moving. Oh dear. Can we help the people nearby? Prob well, with just three of us wounded and overburdened. Um, quite possibly. Uh, not. So, quite possibly not, just to be clear. That is. Mate, your guy's pathfinding is terrible. Walk this way. You're like. But we will stand at the top of a cliff and look at the logs and wish we could have them. Yeah, that's uh, not going to help too much. So essentially, we lost three, four party members there because of the, um, one of those four company members now is a prisoner. And all capturing prisoners does is reduce suspicion, like reduce our wanted status. So, poison is a massive problem, right? We need lots of medicine. We need people with medicine skills. We need people who won't die of poison. Are we all wounded? Three of us are wounded. You're a prisoner. Okay, so, you are wounded. Um, you just got a sprain. Um, you a laceration okay can look at no critical hits but oh that is nasty right so the people we're looking to in terms of the money uh bandits are, okay no no we we leave no no they need they need protection we are in no fit shape to protect anyone we're going to have to leave and come back. We're taking this wood, though. So, man, that influence is going to be a killer, right? Um, yep, we're having all that. That's a godsend, but, um, hmm. Losing this many people in the early game means that we won't get the influence quick enough to replace them. Um, in terms of survival, we have Ferran, who's like just 
still are pretty basic. Ublin gets slow. Yeah, so they do get better as they go up, but so many people die off that it's basically hmm. I'm thinking, is there an imbalance issue that needs to be considered, right? Am I? Because basically it's as if the game expects me to have much better equipment and it's not massively difficult, right? But it's difficult enough. I think with more familiarity and, you know, more familiarity with the system, more... Oh God, I'll be quicker on the road. No, I keep cutting through the forest. It's fine. We're nearly there now. We'll have to camp soon anyway, and then we'll get to eat some food. Right, what can we do with all these? We can sell a load of this stuff. Outlaws change. Right, this. We want to... Ooh, hello. Right, so... Hmm. Hmm. Eight. Ten. Can you wear this? Yes. And it will need repairing, obviously. Oh, we can do that. And that lightens our load. Excellent. I don't like the inability to repair unequipped items. Because we might need them. If we sell them, they get a full mend. All right, so what else do we want to be learning? Uh, we still don't know what that is. We haven't started the scenario for this region yet. Oh, level three. We are so screwed. Okay. They came out of nowhere, just rushed out at us, squealing and oinking. Uh, can we just run away, please? That'd be really great. Yes, yes, we want to give up the battle and not fight. Uh, we got no experience. Armor got damaged. Maybe we got some injuries. Let's mend all the armor and go before they attack us again. It could happen. It could really happen. We're going at full speed here. Look at us struggle. Oh, yeah, yeah. F fight them. No, don't ignore... Ugh. Disgusting. Right, well, look. Let's camp and pretend that we can heal our injuries. We can't, obviously. Um, we've got no medicine. We can not build anything useful there yet. Let's... Uh, Eat some of this. Oh, we don't need that much. Right. And some mushrooms. Pay wages. Uh, did we need to rest? Probably. I hope they don't succumb to their wounds. Lost five influence because they're unhappy. Well, of course they are. They're knackered. And everyone who signs up with us seems to die. So the question is, when we get someone experienced, like our chap with the two-handed sword, will they end up carrying the whole um, the whole team, essentially? But, you know, this, this bunch of low-level nobodies who, keep, who sign up are like, Oh, hello, I'd like to come with you and go on an adventure and get killed by bandits in the wilderness, or boars, or wolves, or something. And we're like, no, please don't, you'll just die. Yeah, that grizzled old veteran, he's like, Oh, you're shit, you'll never make it. Well, I mean, uh, the cost to hire people now is 20 and 40 gold. Right, yeah, so look, can we have our pay, please? Thank goodness for that. Right, any other nice jobs we can take? Easy. Help desperate refugees, we take taken that already, right. Old lighthouse, we've taken that. Hard, hard, average rat infestation. Uh, there might be a lot of rats. We might not be might not be capable of dealing with them. Right, so. If we leave, go here, say, what can we make? Oh, you're, you're injured. Right, you can't. Okay, fine. Oh, oh, bother. Right, okay, fine. Hello, we need medicine. Can you, um... 
Heal us, please. Lovely. Gonna regret that. There's a lot of money. Right, will you buy our useless crap? Sorry, the, the equipment of our dead companions. No longer with us. Right, that's a little bit better. We got some more money now. And we need to uh, not use it all. Right, Ooblin. You make stuff, allegedly. We still don't have enough cloth. Can make two of those. This, though, would get us a new recipe in the compendium. That'll get us knowledge. That won't. There we go, then. Hit it! On the anvil! I clicked that. Oh, well. Uh, normal quality, fine. Um, still need more cloth. Can we sell that? Yeah, absolutely. Probably should. While someone could use it, we really need the money. And with that leather, we could make quite a lot. Oh, we could make like a tent and stuff, couldn't we? But we don't have everything we need for it. Um, hmm. Oh, oh, ye of, of suicidal nature. Um, you are a bloke we don't with a two-handed sword pickpocket. You got first aid, though. You are a first aid, two-handed axe, brawny. Bonus, do it. And you, Nordwin, we can't have you. Simple as that. Now, new fellow, fine fellow, Siganor. Can we give you stuff? Yes, we... Well, no. Apparently not. Okay, fine. Uh. Oh, well. Let us depart. Let us get a little bit of medicine. Gonna regret this, but... 39! We can't afford the damage. Nope, misclick. I was going for market. Can I sell you some stuff? Oh, what's this? Venison. Expensive stuff. Right. Uh, lots of things to... S Can I sell you dead bodies? No. Well, yeah, but I wouldn't get anything from... Uh, so we can make stuff here. Ooh. Ooh. It was you, wasn't it? You have no cloth for us to purchase. Okay. With that established, we will leave town, make camp, pay up. What? Okay, fine. Not complaining. And then out this way, over here we're needed, over down there we're needed. Right. If we go out there, we need something else along the way, right? We... Gotta go this way. Fine. Hmm. Okay, so obviously, let's see. Troop size is getting worse. So they don't like having... They thought 7 was too small. I mean, okay, you know. So, last battle lost, yeah. Probability a companion will leave, 20%. Okay, well look, we gotta tough it out. And see if we can survive, I suppose. And I've probably been recording for far too long again. Um, hmm. So, let's have a little talk. Um, it's not... 
while the um you know the comparisons to battle brothers is obvious it's also very different right the class changing uh like specialization perk thing where we can have brothers essentially um gaining classes as they level is uh interesting let's say what do we got here yeah we'll take it look we're just desperate right now okay oh it's up this way is it really up uh, up that hill well all right then let's do this big fight and uh, see if we'll die but yeah so the company management is very different right in in one regard it feels much more personal and oh dear god that's it isn't it that is our our target yes all right we're gonna die uh yes we will fight and if we're really lucky we'll all live and we'll have a prisoner to take as well so are we supposed to indulge in lots of bad behavior right you're all around here we oh hello you are going first you're going second right you're getting oh mate you're poison as well that's really bad news okay let's pop you here then pop you here Right, I think we're good. Okay, Ublin. Please move to there. Then throw this spear at this poisonous bugger. Then keep moving to there. And hit the poisonous bugger with a hammer. That's a really good beginning. End your turn. Right, Ferran. Please move to there. And... Pokey pokey. Yeah, that's right. And we'll get that point. We're on max points now, so we want to be careful how we spend them. Yep. Take it on the armor and shield. You know you can do it. Oh, you can't get there yet, right? You can rush to here. Maybe get a... No. Go to there. Everybody? Yeah, I mean, look, he's got a, a shield, okay, so he can tough it out a little more. And you can just run up to there and hope to live. And you are a nasty bastard. With poison, of course, with poison. But we have something we can do about that. We can say, hello, we can fix poison. Uh, we just need to move. Poison fix. And then move again to like here. It's big swing. Nice. And you're still not... Oh, wow. Okay, we'll just run up and engage this one then. Okay, can you... Go to here and be like, hey, I want to hit both of you with this big ass two handed sword of death. Look, it won't get us for kills, but it'll keep us all alive. Hey, everybody, stay alive because this is a tough fight. And it's bloody poison again. Right gonna bash to there and you mate get whacked all right can we do this yes we can that's lovely This has got to be some kind of morale thing, right? Like how we're winning and losing. Okay, let's see. Kill enemy units to raise your morale meter and claim victory faster. 
Your units become galvanized, significantly boosting the damage they deal at this point. And then you win the battle at this point without having to kill them all. Well, I think we're gonna kill them all anyway. No, let's not. Because we might get into another fight. Right. You're new. But it's going to be you, apparently. Why can't... You can go, that's great. So, being new means you should get some of the experience points. I don't know if we're getting kill experience or anything special, so I'm just... Right. Can't mend everything. Can mend one person's gear. Let's continue. Uh, reach level 2 in the trade and wealth path. Possible to negotiate missions went away way too fast then, so I'm just going to have to go look at it this way. Uh, it's not there, is it? It's, um... Okay, so... There must be a way to do all these things. And it would probably be good to look in between episodes and see what I can do, but at this early stage it's more of a case of just looking at it and going, good grief, what can I actually manage? Um, crime and chaos. Do nasty criminal stuff, I imagine. Can craft the lectern. Probably a good idea. I'd probably be able to use that in camp to make stuff, right? Right, what's this? What can I do here that I... Oh! Yes. Must be a thief. Can anyone be a thief? Yes, they can. Who should be a thief? Um, well, you're the only one who can at the moment because everyone else is like a bit knackered, right? Lose all experience gains as a tinkerer. Well, he's not done very much of it, right? You've been working as a blacksmith, that's great. You've been working as a tinkerer as well. You, on the other hand, can be a thief. Oh, I could have... Right. Um, what am I trying to do? Oh, that worked, somehow. Alright, we get some carp, wine, and mushrooms. That's all great we could do with that before we leave. Anything else up here we can... There doesn't seem to be anything else to interact with here. Ah. Let's try. Oh. Ooh. Okay, that's... Yep, that's leaving. That's... We ain't... We're not opening that in a hurry. Um, nothing else, I think. If there was a key, like alt or control or something to see things, but there isn't. That would have been very helpful. Alright, let's go pick this up on the way. Uh, do we get that as well? Probably yes. But that mist, it looks dangerous. Um. Oh yeah, that looks... That's just birds, but not a safe place for us to be. Oh, it's the Lund Farm again. Wonderful. Right, well, look, let's uh, head along the road. Camp. And we will say, you, my fine friend, would love to repair your gear, but we can't. You will repair yours. Nobody's significantly injured. Right, we'll eat that because it's heavy. We'll eat that because it's not so heavy. We'll eat that and some mushrooms. There we go. So 
So yeah, we're definitely getting that sort of survival of the fittest feel. As, you know, fresh-faced, young, innocent, naive folk join up with us and perish. Hmm. So, here's something. When I go to save the game, I can't save over an existing save. I get to enter a new save game name and it does automatically replace the existing save for this company. It doesn't modify the save for the other company who perished, but I deleted that earlier, so I haven't tested having two saves going currently. So, I like the fact that we only get one save for the company. Um... but I also feel that it would be nice to save over it manually. But no, so it's saving over it automatically, so that's a good thing, right? We need you to mend stuff, mister, but no, no, no. We need to go get our reward. Hello. We would like to get paid, please. Do you have any jobs? Especially ones that would go eastwards. Average rat infestation. Anything that's not those rats. So that average was reasonably tough for our level. But there was no poison. You. You. I can just right click on them and examine. That's great. I don't think we can reasonably... Hang on. 30 and 60. We could recruit one more person, but I don't think we could afford them. We still don't have the cloth. We can't make anything here. It would be nice to get a new, um, a new thing. Right, so. Let's sell this. Um, a trinket, so someone can equip that, right? It doesn't seem to do anything. Uh, maybe there's some kind of significance of religious affiliation that could help. I'm not sure, but... One, two, three, four. Ah, uh, how long till the new jobs are available. Four more hours. Okay. Well, you know what? I think that's a reason... I have to leave town to save anyway. I think that's a reasonably good place to leave it, though. So, I'm going to stop here now. I hope you've all enjoyed this episode. Bit of a long one. But I'll look forward to seeing you all in the next one if you'd like to stop by. I'll say bye-bye for now, though. Cheerio, everyone.